I don't only do love after lockup videos on here. I do other videos as well. So make sure you go check them out. I talk about everything pertaining to life. So make sure you go to my playlists and check them out. Check out what I've got to talk about. They're very interesting topics. I don't see many people talking about some of these topics that I talk about. So I know you want to go check that out. So please do. <laughs> It's time for love after lock up, baby. Lacey, Shane, and John. Hmm. Wow. It's a lot. The methadone, it's a, it's a blocker. You know, it actually, it keeps me from, from using. As you may or may not know, the way methadone works is it works as a blocker. So what it does is it changes the way the brain and the nervous system react to pain so when you're on these drugs and stuff like that and um, when you withdraw that can result into pain and the methadone makes it so that your brain and your nervous system react to it differently it also ensures that the euphoric effect of drugs that that goes away right it blocks it so it's very very helpful for people who are on it but people who are on it also need to wean off of that right because it has a lot of side effects we will, which we will see later on as well so it is imperative that people wean off methadone as well and then they are completely they're not dependent on anything at all but it's imperative that he goes to this clinic and get his dose and they will be reducing it until he's completely off of it but that has to go slowly or else he will still feel the side effect of the withdrawal effects basically of stopping of being clean basically times like this is pretty much exactly when i need it Lacey's always been a trigger for me to go back to use it you can't just stop going to the methadone clinic you gotta wing yourself off dear Lacey. She got the letter. She got the letter. We thank the Lord she got the letter. Okay, what does it say? I know you really don't care, but I'm writing you this letter, and it's going to be the last time that you're ever going to hear from me again. I know what you did, and I hope our paths never, ever cross again. Best wishes, John S. This is She's looking around like he's there. No, this happened last night, baby girl. You missed it. You missed him. The pattern of John's behavior, and you know, I hope that he really gets the help he needs to, you know, change that and move on and be a better person for himself. He's always, you know, going to have a huge. She literally is crumbling the thing. Wow. Okay, Lacey, you're done, done, huh? Straight to the bin. And straight together. But John and I are completely done. So, I guess, uh... Those drones are putting in work. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I just feel nauseous. All of a sudden, okay, he's been recording this thing for like hours, okay? Because we've seen him in this blue shirt for maybe months, okay? Doing these confessionals. So he's probably been in there for hours and all of a sudden, John's not doing too great. Happy with the girls too. I'm just glad. Yeah, and I spared you the rest. So basically what happened is he feels very nauseous. He probably throws up. Um, we can hear all kinds of noises and things. And that's the, the effect of the methadone as well. That's that's one of the side effects of methadone itself, which is why you need to wean off of that because it's not like it's great. It is an antidote for one thing and then brings its own problems, right? Which is why. If there's one thing we've learned from this, don't do drugs. Don't, don't do it. Don't do it. It's not worth it. People think they can go on it and hop off of it. They're celebrities who have passed away because of the hold that it had on their lives. Just don't do it. In any case, in other news, Shane and Lacey over here, they're in, in cloud nine and he's painting a wall, a very, very pretty pink, but they don't know if it's gonna be a boy or a girl yet. I am so in love with this man. And I'm Finally, we hear you say this. Finally, you, we hear you say that you're in love with somebody because, child, we did not know. I'm happy that we're having a little baby. You hear my voice in there? I know that no matter what, me and Shane will always have each other's back. <laughs> And they do a reveal and it's a girl it's so cute and I love this reveal because it was nice and simple they've been all these extravagant uh, baby gender reveals these days and one became fatal 
it was one of these explosion things and it became fatal for the dad the dad actually passed it was very very sad go look up that story just keep it simple okay we know you're excited but you need to make it and actually be there for the kid right all these theatrics and for who and for what you, the people are not going viral for this they're not cutting a check off of this we don't care you know even on youtube even if you get a million views is it going to be worth it in the grand scheme of things people are doing crazy crazy baby reveals i love this one so simple it's it's a firecracker thing if it comes out blue then it's a boy if it comes out pink it's a girl it's great and the kids well she has two boys already they didn't want a boy uh, they didn't want a girl sorry but the girl really wanted a girl so she's ecstatic <laughs> Look at that, she's just running through the pink <laughs> cloud, which is so cute. But then things take a turn and it becomes really serious because she's in the hospital. She had an epidural in her back and she's going to explain what happened after that. I started to develop a very severe headache and they decided to do a uh, CT scan after trying a bunch of medications that just was not working huge air bubble traveled from the epidural site of my spine up into my brain because that is very scary that is very very scary brain aneurysm i'm just grateful because the brain aneurysm it's it's actually scary summer is doing great but this the baby's is great baby summer rain she is still person so they put Lacey on bed rest for a bit. So go read up on it. It's very interesting how after having epidural, uh, air bubbles can follow and basically travel through the brain. Yeah, go read up on that. Don't be scared though. Have your babies. It's a blessing. It's necessary. Healthcare is good. Uh, make use of it. And yeah, I'm glad they found this out. But yeah, it's a, it's important to read up a lot. Um, probably before going into labor so that. You know the things that can happen or maybe not just live your best life because it's scary the stuff that can happen but in any case in this case um they had a baby girl and her name is summer and she's so cute but i don't show babies on this channel so you not get to see her here i cannot stop <laughs> loving her and shane is what's his name shane? yeah that's his name i would get shane and sean mixed up and then there's john shane sean john Say that a few times in a row. In any case, um, yeah, he absolutely loves the daughter. So cute. Appreciate everything you're doing. Love you. Well, as long as you love me, that's all that matters. I love you. No, I we wish we had seen this energy from Lacey ages ago when she was out here being Michael number two. I said it, I said it. She was the female version of Michael up in this piece with her two men, two side pieces, and we didn't know who she was really in love with, who she really loved, who she really wanted to be with, who she really wanted to do life with. It was crazy, it was wild. But yeah, so in any case, um, we are glad to see it and we're glad to hear it. This makes me extremely happy. Man, I love you so much. Because this young boy is trying. 22 years old, he's about 10 years younger than she is. And he's trying, taking on these three kids that are not his own and really making this thing work. It's amazing. In other news, John is all better, okay? He's out here, he's going on a date. They made sure to show her shoes. Ah, the more you're in quarantine, the more you're like, why was I bothering myself wearing these high, 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 high heels that I can't even walk in? We pretend we can walk in them, but it is painful, okay? If any woman you see walking on these things, there is pain involved. You look cute, but there is pain involved, okay? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, why does she talk like that? She's like a lacy number two. She's like a lacy number two that this guy has gone. It's a lot. I don't even understand guys at this point. They say they want natural girls. Then they also go for the girls that are all done up to the max. You can tell that everything about them is fake. And it's no disrespect, but like literally, they want all natural. But you see people in the media, celebrities, who, 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 people around you just going for the plastic and fantastic. It is wild. But anyway, this girl's name is Julie. Julie so, or Julia, something like that. On this date with this girl, Julie. Julie. Oh my God, like this girl is beautiful. You look amazing. Yeah. You look amazing. Oh well. So do you. So, so glad you came here. Hey, I 
<laughs> this girl really came today with chewing gum. I don't know if she forgot, but I don't know if it's all that nice to be sitting opposite somebody on a date that you supposedly have never met before, but still on a date and be like, mm -hmm. I know about that. Thank you. Mm -mm. <laughs> it's so funny how they edit these things. You mean to tell me he didn't ask more about her work? Are you sure? In any case, then she's like, yeah, it's good. Anyway, in any case, my business is going good. Like <laughs> these people <laughs> are really trying to make these people look so funny. But anyway, I'm glad to hear he has a business. Go ahead, y'all. Heating and air conditioning business, and she likes it makes his own schedule. It's more time for a man who makes his own schedule. It's more time for her. If Julie really likes me, she won't really care about what my past is about. Dropping Lacey, getting her out of my life, and he's dropping Lacey. Yeah, that stuff was toxic as anything. Lacey isn't even the same person as she was with him. See how people can change how you are and the type of person that you are. That is scary too. The toxic chick that she is. And Lacey looked way different. She's gotten more lip fillers. She's maybe had a nose job. I don't know, Lacey, please just stop. Please just stop. She was so beautiful before and I know that's just me saying this in its own body in its own life and she can do whatever the heck she wants to do but just don't do it to the point where now you're gonna have proper breathing problems because you've been doing so many nose jobs. You're gonna get infections and useless things because you're just always getting stuff done just please stop I enough is enough just just don't and the bad thing see this was horrible she called him a b word and then she was like and what you what you gonna do about it? what you go what you gonna do about it what you gonna do about it i don't like when women do this because the guy obviously will not want to hit you back and stuff like that but this is not okay you can't be hitting guys and guys cannot be hitting women. It's vice versa as well, but this is just not okay. Things that she's done to me. Put him in prison, literally. <laughs> I still don't know what happened that night. I still don't know what happened the night that he went to prison. Do any of y'all know? I've been asking so many episodes. I don't know if anybody knows what happened that landed him back in prison for 11 months. We do not know. This man lost a year of his life and we don't know what the heck took him there. But in any case, have made me a bad person. I thought it was going to say have made me a better person because he learned a lot of lessons, but no, it made him a bad person. So again, don't let somebody influence how you are and what kind of person you are in this world and how you're going to portray yourself in this world. Here on now, I just want to settle down with the right woman and um, be a good father figure someday. Be happy and live my life. That's a good idea, and I hope this Julie can help you now. Let's see the updates. Shane, Lacey and Shane are happy and in love with baby Summer Rain. He loves her. And John has stayed clean and sober since getting out of jail, which is amazing. Well done. He's dating Julie and has not been in contact with Lacey. We love to hear it. Period. Well, was it a pleasure meeting these folk? I don't know. They gave me a lot of stress. <laughs> They sure did. I know we're probably not going to see these people again because there's not much to see. Everybody's going their separate ways. And now it would just be a let's see these kids grow up show. I don't think there's much more to see about these people. And I think they don't, you know, you didn't really see them much out here in these social media streets looking for attention. They were just focusing on themselves, doing them and living their best life. I wish them the best. I wish them the best. But uh, I've already pointed out the things that we can learn from this couple. It's quite a few things. Um, don't let somebody else be able to drive you to use and ruin your life and be sent back to prison and stuff like that. Get out of toxic relationships. This woman literally hit this guy in the face. You don't do that. This That, that relationship was toxic as, toxic as anything. And if you're with somebody and they're dealing with other people and it's so blatant. Lacey wasn't even hiding it. She was just like, <laughs> I, big daddy's home and you gone. Like she entertained all that crap. She entertained it all. So when you see that somebody's doing that, hey, it's good that they have a baby now. Um, but you know, I still feel like she really didn't treat him very well. And I'm glad that she's singing his praises now and how she appreciates him and stuff like that because she she should because she really treated him very, very badly. Very, very, very badly. Um, so yeah, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. That's it with these people. Um 
in any case if you're not already part of the family make sure you hit bump stump as zone to that subscribe button comment because i really want to know what you think like because you obviously like this video and hit the notification by watching it i'll see you in the next video which will be tomorrow daily videos up in here in the meantime make time for glorious life it's time to start what living it right god bless mm -hmm.